Okay. Getting right into it. As I futz with my mic again. It's Wednesday, not Friday. This four-day work week is uh, already throwing me out for a loop here. We're doing Diverse World again. We did Capitals last time. Now we're just going to include the entire goddamn planet. And probably get a very bad score. How we doing? How are you doing? How is everyone doing? And by asking that question, I give myself complete liberty to just talk myself and fill you in on what's the most important thing. And that's me. I can't even say that with a straight face. Um, right now I'm thinking we're <clears throat> Mediterranean, potentially Central America. I don't know yet. These types of roads have me a bit thrown for a loop as to where we are. All I know is they use Roman numerals for numbers. Past that, uh, I got nothing. See, I did see a street sign, and I have to wait 25 minutes for it to focus, and we're never going to see it. Great. All right, we've got Agriturismo Il Mirto. Telephone makes me think this is Europe. I mean, if you had to ask me what I thought a South American phone number looked like, I couldn't fucking tell you. This kind of feels like that. Uh, yeah, as we mosey on through another week, school's starting, if it hasn't already, um, at least here in the United States. I don't know what it is like in the rest of the world, but, um, yeah, I don't notice it as much, thankfully, in the, uh, travels I have to have going to and from work, which are a bit longer than normal, as I've stated before. Does anybody just happen to have a flag outside there? Outside. Man, I... Now I think this is Central America. If not like Brazil. I'm thinking Brazil right now. This road doesn't make me think Brazil, but all the houses make me think Brazil. The landscape doesn't make me think Brazil. I am... Hating this one. Just outright... Detesting it. I don't know what to do with this one. It's a long ass string of a road with uh, vineyards, which I feel are more of a Spanish or Argentinian thing, maybe even Chilean, but none of this feels like that. Like Lucian, this could be Italy. I, I, I don't know. Okay, SP. 65 makes me a little bit more confident. Let me first take a look down here. What are your highways? Okay, none of those look to be that. I'm going to get such a terrible score on this one. Just K40. All right, so I'm just looking for potential like smaller routes with it. All right, so we're not here, and my mouse isn't zooming. SP is Brazil. I just remember that because SP is the uh province we're in so we're in sao paulo now the problem is sp65 finding it i don't know if i have enough time this is probably farther north in the country and i am panicking now sp65 it feels like it's a larger fuck Well, I got nothing. You heard my logic and why I went through what I did. I'm going to stick with it. I could not, cannot, for whatever life of me, remember, decipher, figure out what's the difference between Portuguese, Spanish, and apparently Italian. Um, that's just awful. I have no excuses. I am going to work as hard as I can to forget that. As you see again, GIMP is open on the side. 
now I'm being pouty. This makes me feel we're in the U.S. This could be Canada. I don't know yet. It's Century 21 is a real estate agent agency. A lot of churches. Convenience store. We have the Canadian leaves. Hmm. We have, what do we got here? You want to do Chuck for, Chuck, Chuck for charge? Chuck Hanford? Sounds like a man who can get things done with his hands. St. Francis of Assisi's Roman Catholic Church. I'm just going to sit here and suppress my upsetness at myself and just repeat everything I see in a sign here as I try to remember why I do this in the first place. Two rivers transit, two rivers, that is usually a thing that you know about in... Um, no, you don't, because that's three rivers. Three rivers is a Pennsylvania thing. This is not that. This probably has the province seal in Canada where we are, but I can't make it out. We've got Wilderness Edge. Man, these are just shitty enough quality images that any more zooming in. Do you need this many churches? I mean, this is just indulgent at one point. Like, if some person just came here and just like, yeah, you can try to split the hairs between what's Lutheran, what's Catholic, and all that other stuff, but come on, y'all can share the same place. You know, you can spend more money trying to figure out how to get a better camera in the year. All right, we've got .ca. So, Manitoba. Feel a little better now. Now I need to find Pinawa, whatever the hell this is called. Pinawa, here we go. Wilderness Edge Retreat. I'm going to hit home, and maybe I can... Pinawa Alliance Church. Golf Club. We've got the suspension bridge. All the Pinawa Alliance Church. Great. Uh, we are in front of what I'm going to... That's Burroughs. So Burroughs... No, we were on Burroughs. We want Best Bro. So yeah, we're like here. Anyway, I'm going to say it for the next 20 seconds and feel a little better about myself at the complete redemption that we've just done. And review the weekend, I guess, since the last one was on a Saturday. Oh my God, so much is done. I did get the hike done. Uh, feel pretty good. No adverse reactions to it. So feeling pretty confident. Um, did more things that... I normally wouldn't figure I would do as far as like manual labor and stuff because I generally hate doing that stuff. But things you do for people you care about. Uh, this makes me think we're either in the Rockies, Canada, or like northern, central, western America. That's where I'm standing with this right now. But things you'll do for people. I was stripping paint. On a porch. Okay, we are not in the U.S. Because that is a kilometer sign. Slowly shifting, potentially New Zealand. Uh, nothing else has come to my purview. Well, maybe if this was in focus. We're in meters. Okay, again, doesn't help me. Uh, but I was stripping paint on a porch, and even talking to other friends, like, if you, if you, like, went back in time, I've said this a bunch of times before, when you talk to, like, younger versions of yourself, and you're <clears throat> talking about things either you're excited about or willing to actually spend non-work time doing, uh, I know at least me would just be like, what the fuck are you doing? It's your day off. Do day off things. Like, not work. If you're gonna get work, if you're gonna work, at least get paid for it. Uh, okay, maybe this vehicle might tell me something. 
we are driving on the British side of the road. Now, is this New Zealand or is this, this is that bridge sign just coming the other way. Or is this Australia? I mean, we're going to go from 20 points to 5,000 to probably four again, because I'm not seeing anything. Let me know where we are. It's a very pretty view, though. I'm leaning New Zealand right now, but it very well could go anyway. I'm not seeing a lot of sheep. That tends to be a uh, common thing you see around. Oh, wait, 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 those were probably sheep. Yep. All right. Got some vineyards here. Um, I want to say I heard somewhere that one of the islands is far more preferred as far as vineyards, but that doesn't mean anything to me. Matua. Let's see, does this actually show me? No, it doesn't. All right. Well, I'm going to pick New Zealand. I feel like we're down here. For no reason other than it's flat. You got some rocks. You got some mountain views. I don't see any water. But we're switchly, switchly, quickly going from uh, paved to dirt. Because I think they're just doing a bit of construction. But I'm hopefully clicking fast enough to get to a different part of the road. Where I can actually see something besides this goddamn road. And tiny little building somewhere. But anyway, talking... And doing things that I really wouldn't think I'd do for, I wouldn't call it fun, but just like, I'm okay doing this. Paint stripping definitely wasn't one of them. And that's basically what I did for a three day weekend. Um, I did hike. Hike was definitely fun and worth it. That was very enjoyable. But then it was paint stripping. And. Not dying. I mean, that's this kind of what my weekend was. I did start the new book, 1491. I'm a bit, um, I don't know if sold on the book premise is too strong of a word, but um, it's basically just trying to work at, uh, <clears throat> got the island right, basically trying to just work at what history was like before Columbus came to North and South America and the cultures and everything that were there. Well, I know the country. And learning about it, and that's fine, but a lot of it, it's, it's taking some time to do a lot of swiping. Or, you know, they, with most books, you know, there's going to be some citation stuff, and I know they do actually have a glossary in the back with some links to, like, research, and, like, when he states a fact, it'll probably be put in there, but... Some of the things I haven't seen footnotes for, and I'm assuming that it's probably in the back. I'm just not spending time looking. And it's a lot of like, oh, by the way, this this long known um, theory that you know people came over in the Bering Strait, you know that that's that's slowly being disproven day by day. And it's one thing to be like, yeah, there's a lot of history of people and cultures that were here way before Columbus was, but it's another just be like, oh yeah, well, you know piss on your piss on the grave as you walk by it I guess anchor is that beer I think it is you see either that or cigarettes I mean just because it says smooth and it's fine you can like I said talk about the uh, I feel like we're near the coast just because they have these types of houses that are a little higher off the ground but that doesn't mean anything because maybe it's just the style of house they have in this country. But it, 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 it almost feels like a, we've spent all this time and I want to have my cam, cam, Camera Sastra Institute. It's a very fancy building, though. Seems a little out of place here, but <clears throat> I'm not here to judge. I feel we're like Water is like over there, but I can't tell. These are some weird trees too. They they're very either very young or they don't grow that high. Hmm, okay, come on, focus. Thank you. Can I get it like a highway sign somewhere? 
Like, is this one over here? It disappeared. Oh, we're in some flood plainage. Yeah, there's a bridge up here. Maybe this will tell me a thing or two. Come on. All right, we've got what? Cambodian People's Party. I mean, do we need the signs up just to remind people they exist? Seems a bit redundant and much. I'm sure this sign right here probably says it too. Nope, it's saying what it is. Let's back up a bit. I want to read this. Oh, we're right. No, I thought we were like right on the uh, border, but I'm going to put us like here. Blood damage emergency re reconstruction progress along in Kong Prevang. Kong Prevang. Now I got to find that. I don't know if I have 35 seconds to find it, but Kong seems to be, or Krong, excuse me, seems to be a very common word. It's like town, city. Kong Pre, that's close. I'm not seeing it though. I, I almost feel like I should click there because I had two of the three words, but. I don't think that's right. Calm. I wasn't that far off. Uh, yeah, it does say it. I just couldn't see it because I got shitty eyes. And there's definitely no way I'm getting 20,000 again after that god-awful first one, but... What could I do, man? There was nothing I could do. And in, I'm thinking this is Ukraine just because of the colors. That's all I got right now. I think it would be fitting if I got less than what I got in the first score. But I don't know if that's possible. Let's see, we've got... None of these are non-Russian letters. I'm thinking this is probably Russia. And I think that road sign up here is going to help me. So we've got C H E Chenter, probably center. C H C H E N T R. Iagor Iagorsky Igorsky Iagorsky. B O O N G O O R Bungor Lis Tiagi Lis Tiagi This is a fucking weird roads roadmap here. I don't know where this is. I'm gonna go back and maybe one of these signs might tell me something. Nope. We've got tires here. None of these help. All right. Let's come here. Maybe you'll help me. Hmm. These are some weird ass. Names of motor company. Sib motor. Siberian motors. Are we like... We like in the middle of the uh, of Russia, like not so much in uh, like to the west, just because of the Siberia Cyber Sib motors makes me feel Siberia for no reason. Like I mm, now I'm not thinking this is uh, in uh, Ukraine. I, I don't know. None of the names actually, like, showed up. I don't remember any of them anyway, so maybe... Wasn't this one of them? I don't think so. I mean, that was close, but it's not... Maybe there's a highway sign out here. 
is this okay architecture styles doesn't tell me anything i almost thought that these were more asian roof style houses but that doesn't tell me anything so 400 oh hit back oh we got right here Motelb Sayuna Motel Sayuna Center Man I got 10 seconds and this is going to turn out to be like fucking Vladivostok or something isn't it Um I'm clicking here Oh okay yeah we were in the center yeah, it's just been a shitty. Oh man, just an awful, awful Wednesday. Uh, I don't know what to do about my inability to remember <clears throat> the uh, the the Italian. Yeah, I've said it enough. Whatever down point for us and Geo guys. It's been a while since we had a shitty one, so I guess we were due. As if it's necessary to have shitty ones, but it's going to happen. Um, all I can say is, well, you got a low score. You can do better than this. Whichever one you do. I just nailed my desk with my hand. Kind of hurt, but anyway, I'm going to thank you all for watching. If you have suggestions for maps or any other games or anything in general, put them in the comments below. And also, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, complaints, anything at all, Along with like, comment, favoriting, and subscribing. Put them in the comments below. I will see you for the finale for the week on Friday. Until then, live long, prosper.